And that's where we start tonight in the Illinois State Capitol. Illinois is another step closer to having a final budget on the books. This comes after a late night push from lawmakers. The Illinois House of Representatives passed the budget just after 2.30 this morning. The 56, $50.6 billion plan includes investments in education, child care, health care, public safety and economic development. Leaders say this is Democratic leaders say this is a fiscally responsible budget that will help everyone in the state. But Republicans argued it's quote smoke and mirrors and gimmicks that make it look balanced. The revenues that are needed for this budget. They are not my money. It is not your money. It is not Republican money. It is not Democratic money. This money belongs to the taxpayers of the state of Illinois, and they deserve better. But the Democratic chief budget negotiator says Democrats are the ones that got Illinois eight credit upgrades with their balanced budgets. If there's any smoke and mirrors, it's this design that it's either all or nothing. That if we don't do everything that everybody wants, then somehow we're doing nothing. You know that's a fallacy. You know that's not how this place works because the fact of the matter of it is you know that the state can't afford that and still be compassionate and fiscally responsible. The budget passed on a vote of 73 to 38. It now heads to Governor J.B. Pritzker, who is expected to sign it as soon as possible.